bladesmiths. I'm gonna be testing the strength and durability of your edge by taking each of your knives and chopping into these solid brass rods. If your knife is tough enough and your edge was designed properly, they should hold up. Josh, you ready? I'm ready. All right. Good job. Josh, the brass rod will tear your knife up bad. There's a little wrinkle, but other than that, there's no chip. Still sharp. Good job. Paul, you're up. You ready? Swing it hard. All right. Paul, your handle feels really good, but we have some pretty significant blade damage right here. Overall, good job. Thank you. Liam, ready? Yeah. All right. So Liam, we've got a little bit of edge deformation. It's almost not noticeable. It's still sharp there. Now that tells me you got a good heat treat on it. When I feel a handle like this, it feels good, but it's a little skinny up here. It tends to want to cant like this. Overall, great job. Thanks. Doug. Bladesmiths, to test your blade's edge and sharpness, I will slash across this fish. If it's sharp, it should cut through. Josh, you're up first. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Well, Josh, your blade is light, it's fast, and it's sharp. It's sliced all the way through. This, sir, will cut. Good job. Thank you. Paul, you're up next. You ready? Yes, sir. Let's do this. Nice job. Nice, clean cut, Paul. Your blade's got some meat to it, some power. This, sir, will cut. Thank you. Liam, you're up next. You ready? Oh, yeah. Liam, your blade design definitely makes it like a chopper. The edge is sharp. As you can see, cut all the way through. The handle is a little bit small and rounded, but nonetheless, this, sir, will cut. Awesome. Good job. Gentlemen, the judges have made a final decision about which of you is leaving the forge. Your blade did not make the cut. Paul, you made a pretty good comeback from round one. However, your heat treat was still the problem. The blade wasn't hard enough, and that's why we're sending you home. Very understandable. Paul, please surrender your weapon and leave the forge. My first canister experience was a pain in the butt. I wish I would have heat treated that thing the first time correctly. I didn't win, but hey, I had fun. I'm still Paul Happy. I'm always happy.